Hello, my beautiful souls. Welcome into your daily read for Saturday, August 12th, 2023. I hope you're doing amazing. We're going to begin and pull an overall energy from two different decks, um, an oracle from the Sacred Forest deck and then a tattoo tarot, and then we'll shift on forward to pull some more tarot. But let's do some initial shuffling and get this going. In the first attempt to get this reading done, I did hear um, an overall message or a beginning message, if you will, of staying in your lane. So you might be keeping to yourself in one, if not multiple ways, in one, if not multiple situations to begin for this day. Courage, beautiful. Um, I am getting from this imagery, there's a light about your energy, a, a glow about you, um, a radiation, uh, a vibration. It could be some of what I just mentioned, but all of which is coming out for a reason. The color yellow, the spiritual meaning coming into play. Um, but I do feel like the courage you have to, for some, begin again to make changes in your life, to be a better uh, version of yourself, to get the job done for some, um, to transform, to rise from the ashes is coming through as well. Um, but we also have enlightenment at the bottom of the deck. There may be a bit of uh, clarity coming to be, um, feeling for some of which drawn to the reading, like myself being uh, a guider or just a, um, an influencer, someone who, a uh, spiritual teacher is what I'm hearing. Spiritual walker is also what I just heard. Um, but somebody who enlightens others in one, if not multiple ways. But let's pull an overall tarot. What else do we have for Saturday? Your voice will be important is what I'm hearing. Um, so we have two, temperance and justice, beautiful, as well as the eight of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. So there's hard work being, being put forth towards something of importance. All right. Um, for some, I feel like there's two different types of justice you're receiving. A sense of you being guided, protected, and um, assisted by the spiritual realm. I feel like even one, if not multiple random spirits joining you throughout this day to uh, gift you with an opportunity, a little boost in this or that, um, a sense of things just working out in your favor throughout this day, at least for the most part. But with the temperance card, I feel like you need to have patience, whether this is people, um, factors outside of you, things affecting you, you just needing to have patience as well with uh, yourself. But going back to that enlightenment card and the fact that we have an eye here, I do feel as if your third eye is opening to an important realization. Um, I'm hearing or remembrance um, that is just very important for you to uh, understand. All right. You might need to remember something to better understand it, but I do feel uh, pouring from your cup into the cup of someone else's. Um, it could be a community, but it feels like it will feel simplistic in the moment, but it means the world to that person, all right? Um, your helpful nature naturally being a part of this day. Um, sincere effort is now what I'm getting. Let's pull from the light seers. What else do we have for Saturday? Um, stay to it and you will see. Very interesting heavy energy coming out. The five of pentacles and the nine of swords. Where things feel stressful, you're being reminded it's temporary or you simply are not meant to be wrapped up with who or whatever that is for you. Um, if you're stressing over any sense of lack, that will be temporary. So keep that in mind. Um, and going back to justice here, you'll gain justice in regards to whatever this ends up being. All right. Um, but for some, there's improvement on the horizon. All right. Now this could be Increase, this could be um, the status, um, the evolution of a relationship, a connection, or um, a job situation, or your business. Um, it feels like, for whatever reason, there's a focus on what stresses you out and how we can improve that. But I also feel like there's a sense of limitation, um, something that leaves you feeling uh, without a choice to move forward yet. Um, la less free time, if I could even spit it out, um, potential lack otherwise. Do you know what I'm saying? I feel like there's also some reflection taking place. Just because it's a day where you're receiving justice doesn't mean it's a day where everything's perfect. Um, and they're saying shiny gold. I feel like um, this day also reminds you that 
not everything that shimmers that is shiny is right for you or even going to be enjoyable or beneficial in the end okay or at least not to the extent you would hope or think um or being led to believe the temperance card again because i feel like there's more than one level of patience you need to have you might find that you have this glowing uh courage about you but angelic energy all the meanwhile um i do sense that it could be because um a spirit if not multiple are surrounding you and that adjusting your energy um in your favor in a lighter way but um almost like you're about to fly away but i do sense that some of which this is naturally the way you're feeling um either way anyways to continue there's certain stressful factors or annoying factors um, uneasiness about a situation if not multiple where you will need to rebalance things out for yourself adjust your energy in your favor um, and not let things carry forward in an unhealthy way if you uh, sense that you can do something about it now I feel like that's in smaller ways like that with your energy but um, that also goes for uh, situations in your life um, habits stuff like that if you can make a change even if it takes some planning some um, adjusting up until that point uh, why wouldn't you want to to improve your life to make things better healthier and potentially more beneficial for you what else do we have the chariot card the five of cups there's going to be a point throughout the day where you just find an energy dip taking place where you feel it's like, wow, I just went from feeling quite alive to just very depleted. And Spirit's saying, don't expect for your energy to pop back up or come back to be. Moving forward to, uh, for the remainder of the day, just accept that you will have to adjust, adapt to that limited energy and resources and make it extend or last um, to do what you have to do for the rest of the day. Um, just a heads up for that but the chariot card the five of cups and the three of swords where there was once or is any sort of uh, emotion heartbreak disappointment um it's leaving you expecting the worst with what you have at hand um even if that's the same situation it could be something different um but i do feel as if someone around you or at a close distance is going through it all right I would say this is not your i'm hearing mess to clean up or to tend to something where you just need to accept that that could adjust your mood your energy the feeling in a situation um and to just notice when it's not you yours to carry in one if not multiple ways um something may disappoint you as well but it feels very minor something about a tattoo if not multiple whether you need to get one thinking about someone else's your own that you already have um meaning to it anyways the chariot card because i feel like it's a day where you are motivated to move forward but again going back to that eight of swords vibe we had before um it's not time yet or you just don't have um everything you need in order to do so all right but there's motivation to in a balanced way do what you have to do all right get the job done make progress and step uh towards success for yourself that justice and spirit saying as long as you keep the motivation alive that courage alive and balance things out and have patience through it all you're going to succeed you're going to gain justice in more than one way and even more so moving forward all right so if this was truly helpful sending you so much love and light go enjoy your day and i'll see you next time